So cataracts is uh, the natural aging of the lens of the eyes. So when we're young, the, the eye, the way the eye focuses, uh, it focuses using a natural lens that's inside the eye. That lens when we're young is clear and has a focusing power and we, we kind of take it for granted. But as we get older and if you're lucky enough to, uh, to age gracefully, uh, your natural lens does become cloudy over time. Nearly every person who lives long enough past age 80 will develop cataracts. So um, most of us have had a grandparent or a parent who has had cataract surgery. As you can imagine, if the focusing power of the eye is lost as a result of clouding, well, the vision will become cloudy. So one of the first telltale signs of cataracts is um, when someone says, you know, at night when I'm driving, driving, I feel like the oncoming traffic, the, the light glares out or I'm not able to see the street signs very clearly. Or a lot of uh, people comment on having difficulty reading unless they have extra light. Uh, so it's really, again, if you can imagine, kind of clouding of uh, a camera lens, for example. It, it's diffusing of the light, it's less contrast, colors don't seem as bright and vibrant. Um, and it, because it happens gradually, a lot of people don't really notice it. They, they assume that it's part of aging of the eye, but what they don't understand is that it is most definitely manageable and treatable. As we get older, especially if someone has to wear glasses to see distance, they may notice that year after year, their prescription glasses change. That in itself can also be part of aging or evolution of just the way the eye is, is, is aging. But when cataract ensues, pres new prescription glasses won't necessarily improve your vision. So someone who's developing cataracts you may notice that, you know, I, my prescription changed, but I wasn't able to see as clearly with my new prescription as I did the last time I had my glasses changed. So that's when cataracts ensues. It's not just a change in your prescription, but it also is clouding of the vision. There is no per se cure for cataract, but there is intervention and the intervention is uh, surgery. And the surgery is the most common surgery done in the United States. We in our practice perform more than a thousand cataract surgeries a year. And it's a very simple outpatient surgery. Uh, essentially the surgery entails um, removing the cataractus or cloudy lens of the eye and replacing it with a new lens implant that will give you clarity of vision. But cataract surgery itself takes anywhere from 15 to 20 minutes. It's outpatient, doesn't require general anesthesia. It's local kind of anxiolytics or uh, just anesthesia involved just to take the, the edge off, a uh, little bit of a twilight anesthesia. It's painless. It's um, um, you come in, you have your surgery done, very minimal discomfort. And then within a day or two, your vision is about 80 to 90% improved. And then the recovery is quite rapid actually within a week um, full recovery of vision and really fantastic outcomes most patients honestly come in and say why didn't i do this sooner why did i put it off it's truly can it can be life-changing for a lot of patients uh, if they have let their cataract um, uh, grow too long and really impact their day-to-day -day life so i really urge you especially with advanced um, technology with the techniques that we use uh, with advanced technology lens implants there really is no reason to delay that opportunity to not only improve the quality of your vision as if it's being impacted by cataract but potentially gain other benefits from uh, the advanced lens technology available to us